part of European and Atlantic integration is also democracy and human rights. And just a few weeks ago, an investigation from an independent Ukrainian media, Bihus Info, said that they were being followed and surveilled by the security service of Ukraine. How did you react to this personally? And can you guarantee Ukraine's Western partners that this won't happen in the future? Um, yeah, thank you for, for your questions. Uh, of course, uh, my personal position that the uh, free media, the freedom of the uh, of the media, it's one of the one of the most important part of the of any democracy society. It's uh, can be discussed, and this is uh, for one of the values for what we are fighting. And this is the base of the our society. And uh, I'm sure you see and listen the very clear and very uh, strong uh, statements of the President Zelensky about it. And we can see the, the statements of the security service and some concrete steps, uh, which was as a result of the situation uh, which you mentioned. I think it's absolutely clear, and uh, without uh, free media, uh, we have not be the first, the second revolutions. And uh, you know, uh, I'd like to add maybe one or two things. Once some journalists ask uh, me about the reforms, and I said uh, that look, uh, uh, we are was not to typical politics and the president first of all Zelensky decided to go to the politics because be a very successful uh, uh, businessman only because he want to live and that his children living in Ukraine and for him is was one of the goal to make reforms to make our country better it's mean that reforms and uh, uh, the democracy of the society, it's in our blood, it's, it's not necessary uh, to say about it. This is the goal, why, and this is the one of the strong uh, uh, piece of uh, our Ukrainian characters, is why we are so strong in, the, in, in these fightings. Because we are, uh, it, and this is the, one of the, significant examples why democracy will win uh, against the autocracy. And the second, uh, please don't forget that I don't know another country in the world who can say and show such significant reforms during such a uh, terrible war. And we're very proud, all of uh, uh, we Ukrainians are very proud that we are so strong that we are fighting and continue to make uh, so important reforms and now European colleagues uh, confirm it as why we received the candidate status and now open the negotiations. Thank you.